Hello, this video is in response to a question about a problem in section 9.1. Uh, the topic in 9.1 is estimating a population proportion, and uh, question number two is specifically about uh, finding the critical value given a level of confidence, and I'm going to demonstrate how to do that using StatCrunch. Okay, so this problem asks for you to calculate the critical value, z, um, and that corresponds with an 84% level of confidence. So an 84% level of confidence is basically how confident we are that the population proportion is within the confidence interval. So um, how does this relate to the critical value? Well, the z, critical value z, um, notice that the subscript is alpha over 2. So alpha represents the level of significance. So <laughs> level of significance and level of confidence are related. The level of confidence is 84%. The level of significance is 100% minus that. So the level of significance for this problem is 16%. So notice it says alpha over 2, and that's because what we're looking at is a standard normal distribution that is symmetric. And when we say 84%, we're talking about the middle 84%. So what I need to do is go into StatCrunch and choose Stat Calculators, and I need to look at the standard normal um, probability plot. So here we are, and what I want to know is, so my um, level of confidence is the middle 84% of this, but I want to know what happens when I get to the critical value. Now the critical value, again, it's symmetric, so Instead of being 16%, I take half of 16%, which is 8%. And I put that in here uh, as my probability. Now notice this is the left-hand side. I want the right-hand side here, so I'm going to change this to greater than or equal to. Change it to 0.08 again. And so here we are. So the critical value is the z-score uh, that represents this top half of my um, level of significance. So it's 8% on either side of my level of confidence here. This 84% in the middle, and then 8% on each side. So here, when I talk about what is the critical value, I'm looking for the value on the x-axis here, where we have 8% of our curve is above it. And so that value is 1.41. I hope this helps.